We're very excited at the Naperville Heritage Society and the city of Naperville to bring Joseph Naper back to Naperville for a second time. We are actually standing on the site of his homestead, which in the summers of 2006 and 2007, we had an archeological dig to discover where his homes were and how he lived. We decided to include public art and what better way to honor our town founder for the first time in history than with a bronze statue. He contacted Dick Loker, nationally known Pulitzer Prize winning editorial cartoonist and also the cartoonist for Dick Tracy for over 44 years, to draw the concept design of a young Joseph Naper bringing the, those first settlers to Naperville. Uh, Dick gave us a drawing, he gave us a wax maquette about a foot tall, and then we engaged a founder, Jeff Adams, out of Inbron Studio in Mount Morris, Illinois, to actually sculpt and cast the statue in bronze. There's about 2,000 pounds of bronze behind me. Uh, Jeff included a tree stump and surveyor's tools, which really shows the contact between settlement and wilderness and settlement. We are very pleased with the statue, and this is very important uh, to Naperville. Uh, this is the first public art dedicated solely to our town founder. This is about 180 years overdue. I know in my life to see something that was in your mind for years and you see it coming to metal. That's fantastic. And the shelf life is only 400 years. I want to be around to watch it.